New at six, millions of floating balls in the LA Reservoir. Our witness news reporter Leanne Suter tells us there are some reasons, some good reasons for this unusual sight. Shade balls away. The final loads of shade balls are dumped into the Los Angeles Reservoir. 96 million black plastic balls helping to save water and maintain its quality. This is a blend of how engineering really meets common sense. We saved a lot of money. We did all the right things. L.A. was the first city in America to use shade balls, which now cover three other reservoirs. The four-inch balls are weighted down with water inside, so it helps keep them in place so that they block out most of the sunshine on the water surface. And that helps protect it from possible algae blooms and helps keep the water in the reservoir. By reducing evaporation, these shade balls will conserve 300 million gallons of water each year. Instead of just evaporating into the sky, that's 300 million gallons to fight this drought. Mandated by the EPA to cover all reservoirs, initial estimates came in at $300 million to cover the 175-acre facility. But the shade balls, which are made in L.A. for 36 cents each, cost less than $35 million. Major savings, both financially and environmentally, setting L.A. ahead of the curve. While it's meeting the minimum standards, we want to go beyond that and have the healthiest water. So, um, so we've been spreading these balls everywhere. Officials say that these special balls last about 10 years. The LADWP says that they will be removed, recycled, and replaced. In Silmar, Leon Suter, ABC7 Eyewitness.